Yeah, I'm going to keep this thing in shot uh, for the whole of Advent, I think, uh, just to give you guys something a bit more interesting to look at and, you know, build the suspense as the pictures gradually reveal. Yeah. Um, anyway, let's go for number three. Why do you give a dog for Christmas? Oh, I'm trying to think. I reckon I can probably guess this. Um, no, nothing, no sort of Christmas dog related puns are coming to my head. A mobile bone. No, I don't think I would ever guess that. Again, puns. And a pencil sharpener. Oh, and it has a dog on it. It fits with the joke. That's cool. Um, that's not rubber, is it? No, no, it's that, that harder kind of rubber. I thought it might be like a, an eraser thing, as you Americans call it. Um, yeah, obviously a stationary company, this. Um, it's a bit random, that, you know, just a picture of a dog. It's not, it's not even Christmas-themed uh, on a sharpener that's, you know, a lot bigger than the sharpener itself. It sort of makes it quite a sort of bulky sort of thing. All three items so far have been quite big. Sort of much bulkier than they need to be. Um, but yeah, that's perfectly well put together. I don't have any pencils handy, so I can't test this sharpener out. Maybe they'll give us some pencils later on. And we can test this sharpener out. That'll be cool. Um, but yeah, if you need a sharpener, that will probably do the job. You know, the thing about sharpeners, actually, is they, they don't wear out or anything. You know, they, they might break. Some of them are a bit flimsy, aren't they? But uh, that looks like a fairly solid one because it's nice and big. Um... I would rather it didn't have this dog thing attached to it. On the other hand, if it didn't have that, it wouldn't really be sort of like a sort of gift sale thing. It would just be a sharpener. So I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent towards that one, I think.